access granted. Hey guys, today I'm going to show you how to make sure that your program uh, doesn't have multiple instances running. Uh, this comes in handy um, if your program wasn't designed to handle multiple instances of itself, uh, cause system crashes and whatnot. And uh, most of the time the end customer isn't too bright and they'll try to do anything they can to screw up your program. So, let's go ahead and do a quick check to make sure that our program only runs once. It's pretty straightforward, pretty simple. Uh, you want to go to your form one load event, so you double click your form brings up the form one load event you need three variables so we'll go ahead and declare those now you're going to need them ps process you're going to need count as integer Oops, integer and you're going to need um, my program as string and this is going to equal your executable name without the exe so we'll just go ahead and um, copy this here rename copy paste it in here okay now that's done we're going to create a loop and loop through all the uh, open processes here and um, and see if any of them match our process name our program name and if they do um, then we'll go ahead and close the program because it's already open okay so we'll go ahead and create that for loop now we'll do for uh, each p in in process dot get processes okay and then um, if p dot process name equals my program, then counts plus equals plus equals plus oops plus equals one. Okay, next p. Okay, so what this is going to do is it's going to check through all the processes on running on the local system, and if they meet, if they if the process name matches your program name, it's going to add it to the count. And it's going to be um, the count will be one then. Okay, so if count is greater than zero, mm, or no, if count is greater than one, yeah, we'll do count is greater than one. Then message box, uh, you can only run one instance. application dot exit okay so let's go ahead and try that out we'll build it let's see here's one opened up see if we can get another one open and we sure can't you can only run one instance of this program okay so that works um, that was it I hope you guys enjoyed it uh, if you have any questions go ahead and comment in the comment box and I'll see you next time